Hello, hello. We are going to be updating this drawer. This is what I consider like the knife drawer, like things that cut apples, scissors, cheese, vegetables, open cans. So it's like the knife drawer. <laughs> uh, this we've had forever. And I want to see, as you can, I don't know if you can see the knives are poking out and everything, but it's fine while it's in there. I want to try putting and using this. So this Joseph Joseph is for nine knives. It looks like it can hold a lot more, but it's just for nine, which is more than fine because that's exactly what we've got. Okay, as you saw in the time lapse, I had a little bit of struggle because of the size of this drawer. You can see how much we lost, roughly that much, um, lost or gained, depending on how you look at it, by putting this in. Uh, while it says that this is for nine knives, I could see that there's just, you know, there's nine slots across. However, this is one, like this is our cheese cutting knife. That was right where this one's at too. So depending on the size of your knives, it can depend on how many really you could fit in here. So that's kind of good. I'm really happy that some of these longer ones fit. We have a whole nother butcher block full of knives for Chad when he's cooking and stuff. So I feel like these are the ones that we use a lot and will get used a lot. I also went downstairs because I have my handy dandy leftover bins here for anything that I need. And the scissors seem to fit really good in here as well as the openers. I kept the stuff that we use a lot definitely towards the front and I stuffed the stuff we don't use as much towards the back. So to me, while this isn't ideal, this is what it is. And we're gonna move on from there. Thanks for watching.